Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is my haul for Tuesday mornings. I just showed my haul for Michaels and Joanne, and this is my Tuesday mornings haul. Um, I got these buttons, and it came with flowers in it. I thought this was so pretty. It has 160 pieces. There's 42 print blossoms, 18 tule blossoms, and 100 buttons. And it's green colors. I love this. And this was $1.99. So I picked up two jars of these buttons. I got two of them. And then they also had in there for um, a lot of you who have Tuesday mornings near you. They are selling the Zutter's Bind It All. Well, I have a cinch. And I'm not going to go out and get a Bind It All. But I did want the Corner Rounder for the chipboard so just in case I want to make my chip my square chipboard round and this right here you can fit up to one eighth material thickness inside of it and this was eleven ninety nine and they do have the bind it all um the kits for forty nine ninety five or forty nine ninety nine so any of y'all who want a bind it all Tuesday mornings do have them and then I picked these up these are metal sliders and ribbons these were 99 cent so I thought these would be really cute for our beach pictures I picked those up and I love this lace and ribbon this is by Prima I really love this this was masculine colors and this was two dollars and 99 cent I really did like these so I got those and then I saw on a couple of different websites like paper tray ink and i also saw this on mftstamps.com there was a metal sheet that they're using to cut out the felt and i'm going to try this to see if this works through my big shot machine for the felt and this was only 2.99 so i was thinking it's probably like the same thing so i'm going to see if it works and i'll let you all know i got this Making Memories stamp set. And I thought this was really nice. And I'm hoping that I didn't pick this up anywhere else. Because I think I saw this on scrapbook.com as well. And I picked this up for $3.99. It might have been a dollar cheaper on scrapbook.com. But I thought this was cute. So I'll pick that up. And then I really did like this paper pack as well. And this was a dollar ninety-nine. This is eight by eight paper so I picked this up and these are the patterns because you can never really have too much black and white paper now these right here when I went to my crop yesterday one of the ladies had the making memories curling tag maker and I saw this in Tuesday mornings the last time I went in there but I never knew what it was for so I just left it in there and when she had it yesterday, it was really cute. So when I went back, they did not have the Making Memories tag curler. However, they did still have the tags. So I'll just go to another store and try to find the tag curler or some type of website to find the tag curler. But I thought this was really a nice tool to get. And these were $4. They were um, the pack of three was two ninety nine, and then she just sold these to me for ninety nine cents since it didn't have a price tag. And I also purchased this Making Memories eight by eight portfolio album. I'm not really sure about this album; it's iffy, but I really like the cover of the album. And I'm thinking about putting my son's um, school pictures in here. I really love the cover. And I said for $5, you really just cannot beat the price. And it did come with some pages and page protectors. But I really like this for the cover in the back of the album. So, I'm going to let you guys know if I'm going to keep it or not. And if I decide not to keep it, I probably will just put it in my giveaway. I'm not going to say until I do the video how many subscribers I'm going to do the giveaway for. But I will do one soon for my subscribers. And I got this also. This was the very last one. 
by Cropper Hopper. This is normally, I believe, um, I think it's like twelve or thirteen dollars or something like that. The normal price. Okay, nine ninety nine. And I got it for four ninety nine from Tuesday mornings. And I actually was looking for another one of these for my paper organizer. So I got this one. I'm hoping that they get some more in. So I did pick this up. And that is my haul from Tuesday's mor from Tuesday mornings. And that is what I got this weekend. And I got nothing done at all at my crop. I think I completed. I didn't even really complete the whole thing. But I did part of a 6 by 6 scrapbook page. That is all I got done at my crop. So I'm going to leave my bag. I'm going to leave all my stuff in my crop bag. So when I go back, I can finish my book and also my pages. They all blamed it on me stating that. I had all these new products and um, they wanted some demonstrations. So I did do the demonstrations of the products and that's the only thing I got done. But we had so much fun though. We had a great time. So I'm hoping that we go to our crop um, in April again. So that way I can get the rest of my items done. So thank you for watching my haul videos and enjoy your day.